Hi guys and welcome to the channel, Andy here. I thought today we will have a little walk around Sydney it's at night and have a look at the, the nightlife and well, just have a look and see what's happening. So come with me on my walkabout. Well, I'm just walking down Huntington Street and actually it, all it is actually full of takeaways. I mean, there's a Chinese takeaway and uh, also Indian takeaway, a Mexico one which is just here. Um, yeah, just takeaways. But let's see what else there is actually to see here in, in St. Neots at night. <sighs> Once again, look, more takeaways. We're heading towards the high street and uh, we're going to have a look around because I think the nightlife in Sydney is, is actually dying. Now before we actually get down to the high street, I think we're going to have a look down. We're going to walk past Pizza Express and then head towards the, uh, the cinema. Right, just in front of me is, is Cine World, and there's a, there's a gym here on the right, and also a restaurant here on my left called Prezos. And uh, to be honest, actually, everything seems so quiet, and it's a Friday night as well. Heading back to um, uh, the High Street, well, in fact, we're going to hit Cambridge Street first, actually, walking past Lidl, and uh, just past that is uh, another like takeaway shop. A, a, USA Chicken restaurant and also an auntie's restaurant as well. I don't know because I've been living in the Far East for some time and also in Africa. Uh, Friday nights, Saturday nights are, are normally, you know, very busy nights. A lot of people walking around and everything. But here, I mean, we're, I mean, all right, St. Neas is a small town, but it, it used to be busy at the weekends. It did. And the streets here are just actually empty. And it's a Friday night, it's hard to believe. Well, we're on the high street now. And once again, a lot of takeaways. I can see a hot spot, pizza and chicken. And there's also a fish and chip shop as well. And, uh, and no one around. We're heading towards a pub. Uh, um, the coach house which is just in front of me on, on my left hand side the other side of the road it used to be called holiday the, the new inn um let's see what's happening there well that was a coach and didn't seem to be um all that busy actually heading a bit further into the town center to see what we can actually see there used to be a pub here called the corner house which is called globe that's all shut up. That used to be a place where people used to go years ago. That's been closed now for probably about, I don't know, about half a year. It's up to lead, but nothing's actually happening at all. I'm walking past the markets, the market uh, square at the moment. Uh, there's a the market kebab place, which is in the, uh, the middle of the, um, the car park there. There's a Ferro Lounge, which is uh, across the road there. Um, that's a new place. It's been open for about a year, I suppose, now, and seems to be uh, quite busy. Years ago, there used to be a lot of nightclubs in Sydney. I mean, at the Falcon, which is across the road from me, there used to be a nightclub downstairs as well. And that used to be quite busy. Of course, the Falcon now is just a, well, it's just a shell of a building not even used it's 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 just um it's empty and i don't know what to do with it right gonna, gonna cross the road and uh, next to the uh, the cross keys muse is the uh bohemia bohemia other night another nightclub that used to be here is the, uh, the brook and barter look at that all closed up, lights off. Once again, probably up to let as well. I think since COVID, just things 
I've not really picked up, especially in some of the entertainment um, venues here in Sydney. It's, um, right in front of me is the um, the bridge, the bridge house. Pub. Now, can you actually believe it? It's a Friday night, and it's closed. As I said earlier, Sydney is it's a bit of a ghost town now on a on a Friday night and probably a Saturday night as well. Right, I'm just walking um, through the, the market square and uh, there used to be a nightclub many years ago called Hollywoods and um, it was down one of these, I think it was down Fisher's, Fisher's Yard. Um, but of course that's gone now that the it's in fact uh, it's all houses there now as well but if if we continue walking down it's starting to rain now um, down there, there used to be another nightclub down where a pub used to be and now it's in fact an Indian restaurant so let's walk down there we're going to go past Steve's taxis taxis waiting for people but no one here now where the Nawab lounge is, um, used to be a pub, and uh, there was a courtyard, and the back of the courtyard, there was a disco. And I can remember that, that was going back to the early 90s, but, um, well, it doesn't exist, it doesn't exist anymore. Another restaurant there behind me, not very busy unfortunately. Well, walking down New Street now, uh, the Bigger Fountain, which is a real live band. Well, that was a Pig and Falcon, and also uh, the Weeping Ash. Both not really that busy, to be honest, for Friday night anyway. So that's it. That's my little trip here. Sitting here, it's the nightlife just to show you what it's all about and actually not a lot actually happening so once again as Andy's saying thanks very much for watching um, don't forget if you haven't subscribed to the channel please do that would be absolutely fantastic and let's hopefully let's hope that the next video is going to be more eventful catch you later bye for now bye bye